Here we are with a column chart for expenses, and we can see our dollar amounts are fairly large. We start at $900,000, then we go all the way up to $1.5 million in 2021. And the consequence of this is really that our y-axis looks a little bit crowded. We can see that there's just a lot of zeros going on here. Macabacus can assist with this and really clean it up. We can select our chart by left-clicking, go into Charts, then all the way at the bottom here, we'll see in other formats, under Y-axis formats, we have two options. One is to format our Y-axis for amounts that are in the thousands and then are going up into the millions. So that's the one we'll want here. Or we could set it for amounts that are in the hundreds and then going up into the thousands. We want the first option. And what it's going to do is it's going to put an M after any amounts that are in the millions and then a K after any amounts that are in the thousands. So this is quite simple, but it really saves a lot of space on the y-axis, and it's quite evident how much better it looks. Thanks for supporting the Macabacus YouTube channel. Hope to see you again. Enjoying these tips and would like to see more of our content? Then hit like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for all your support, and we'll see you over in the next video.